Hi, I'm Miss Walker. I'm doing week one Friday. It's Friday. It's Friday. It's really, it really is Friday today. I'm recording the video on Friday for the whole week. Okay. Yes. So, we are going to be doing patterns with number lines. Now, on this one, you don't have a number line drawn for you on these other ones. So I'm going to go ahead and draw that number line. And number lines have arrows because numbers are continuous. Numbers do not stop going. So this example has an equation. Four jumps of five equals 20. When I do number line multiplication, we read it differently than we do the other multiplication. So one more time, it reads four jumps of five equals 20. That means you're going to have four jumps, one, two, three, four, and you're counting by fives. All right, let's do two jumps of four. So that means I have to be counting by fours. My first tick mark is going to be zero. I always start at zero. If I'm counting by four, I'm going to put a C for counting by. My first number is going to be 4, and then the next number, if you add 4 more, 4, if you double it, 4 plus 4 is 8, or you can count on 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And it said 2 jumps, so I'm going to start at 0, and I'm going to jump to 4, and that's 1 jump. I'm going to jump again to 8, and that's 2 jumps. So, this one is 8. It tells me what I'm going to stop at when I'm counting by 4s. But this is the picture that goes with it. This next one is 4 jumps of 4 equals 16. So, I'm going to go all the way till I get to 16 counting by 4s. Here are my four fingers. My first one is 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I'm not at 16 yet. i got to keep going. 13, 14, 15, 16. And we said four jumps. So this is jump one, two, three, and four. And we end at 16. On the next one, three jumps of four. Again, I'm counting by fours. So, oh, it doesn't give me an answer. Uh-oh. So let's do this one. Starts at 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Y'all want to check it or keep going? I'm going to check it because I need to know if I'm close. Three jumps of four. So zero to four, that's one. Eight makes two. This other jump makes three. There's my three jumps and I ended at 12. I'm going to do this next one a little bit differently. This one says five jumps of three. So I know I'm going to make five jumps and I'm going to count by three each time. So I'm going to have my three fingers here. My first jump is to three. So that's one. My next jump, four, five, six. That's two. My next jump, seven, eight, nine. It's three jumps. I'm trying to get five jumps. Oh, sorry, I didn't count on here. Nine, 10, 11, 12. That's four jumps. Oh, we got one more jump. 12 in your head, 13, 14, 15. And that's the fifth jump. So three times five gives us 15. I'm skipping the part about the patterns because you guys are going to be trying to find some patterns. I just helped you solve it. So here is Friday. And since you guys did so great, great this whole week, 
I'm going to say, give me a hot pepper. That was hot. All right, see ya.